what is up and welcome back to my channel if you're new here hey and welcome my name is journey or if you're a returning subscriber thank you so much for clicking on today's video um i also need to welcome myself back today y'all it has been seriously almost two months since i have filmed and updated you guys here on youtube and i am so sorry i finally had my baby at the end of august um, as you can tell, I don't have that big old baby bump to update you guys with anymore. He is now on the outside and a part of our family. We are just loving him to death and I have just been truly absorbing every single moment with him these past two months. But I am ready to get back filming and just have you guys be a part of our lives again. So today's video is a requested video and we are going to be filming a what is in my diaper bag. Now, I don't think this video is going to be all that interesting because, in my opinion, when it comes to my diaper bag, I think I'm a pretty minimalist person, but this video has been requested quite a few times over on my Instagram because I love sharing, like, all the mom things and all my personal mom tips and things that work best for me. So, if you guys would like um, to stay a little more in tune and up to date with me, my life, my husband, my baby all the things and make sure you guys follow me over on instagram i'll leave my instagram handle right here so make sure you'll follow me over there also please excuse the background noise my dogs keep walking around in the video and typically i would close the door but my son is taking a nap on the living room couch right now and if he wakes up then i want to be able to hear him and then he will join us in today's video but without further ado i'm going to get a sip of coffee because mom life runs on coffee y'all <laughs> I actually ran on coffee before I had the baby, but now having to adjust to like taking care of him all day and like having to get up like one to two times during the night to nurse him, I am definitely needing the coffee. So let me grab a sip of this and we will jump straight into today's video. All right, I think I'm ready. Okay, so this is my diaper bag. This is nothing special, um, but it's definitely been my favorite diaper bag this is my second diaper bag um i actually got both of these through my baby registry the first one that i picked out um is more of like a school backpack um and it was a lot bigger had a bunch more compartments and i thought i was gonna love that but then i realized that like having to carry a baby around having to have a stroller having to have the diaper bag I ended up realizing I just didn't want that big of a bag and like I said I'm kind of a minimalist person when it comes to what I have inside of here so this dog bag has been my absolute favorite um there's like I said nothing that special to it it's just this YB brand I'm not really sure if I can find the link for it I will leave it my dogs are so loud. I'll leave it in the description box down below. But really, it just has this front pocket, two little side pockets, and then the compartment on the inside. Um, I'm not going to mumble on too much about the bag because this is not a review about the bag. But we're going to start with these two outside pockets, the front pocket, and then we will dive into the inside of the bag. So on this side, I just have this little roll of poopy bags <laughs> um these are lavender scented poop bags and y'all I absolutely love these things okay they are amazing um a lot of times my son will have a dirty diaper like in the car or out in public or whatever it is and like I don't want to have to smell that dirty diaper like if I'm stuck in the car with him and don't have anywhere to throw it away and these bags are lavender scented and they are so amazing like such strong lavender smell they smell so good and clean so I just put the diaper in there if I'm out and about and it's just so amazing I got these off of Amazon and they're so great I'll leave them in the description box down below because all you moms need them and they actually come with like a little dispensing roll thing but I just didn't like the way it looked clipped to the outside of my bag this bag had a little slit here which I thought was perfect for those and then on this side I just keep a bottle of water I do breastfeed, so I literally drink water like I'm a fish now. I always drink a lot of water, and then I drink a lot during my pregnancy, but now that I am breastfeeding, I absolutely cannot be without water, or I feel like I'm going to die. So that's all I keep on those two outside pockets. Um, and then on this inside pocket here, um, there is like a little mesh pouch here, 
And then there's three insulated pockets where typically you would keep bottles, but my son absolutely hates bottles, hates passies. I've been trying them like for two months now and he just absolutely refuses. So I've kind of just given up there and I just keep what I need in those insulated pockets instead of bottles. But in the mesh pocket, the first thing I have are some sunglasses. These are some OG Michael Kors sunglasses that I've had for a long time. I like keeping these in here because I just have really sensitive eyes and I always keep sunglasses in my car, but sometimes we take my husband's car and then I don't have sunglasses. So I've just been keeping them in the diaper bag. And then I have three little like travel items that I got out of like the little free baby boxes that I got while I was pregnant. So I have two little aqua four. Um, this one is the healing ointment and this is the healing um, diaper rash paste. So just two of those. And then this little travel boogie wipe, which honestly, these will probably never get used because I forgot they were in there. Um, but rather be safe than sorry. And then also have some gum because me and my husband both love chewing gum. And then in the three little insulated pockets, I only have something in the side to the outside too. Um, and let's see. So first thing in here is this Cetaphil, um, baby wash and shampoo. I keep this because sometimes when we're at his Gammy and Papa's, um, if we stay late, it's nice to just give him a bath there. And then if he falls asleep in the car, he's already ready for bed and we could just lay him straight down when we get home. And then this is the Sensitive Moisture Dove Baby Lotion. Dove is the best brand that I've found for my baby. He just has pretty sensitive skin. Um, and then the last thing in here is just some eucalyptus and tea tree hand sanitizer. Um, I just always have hand sanitizer with me everywhere I go with my baby because before I let anyone hold him, I'm like, do you wash your hands? If you can't wash your hands, I have some hand sanitizer. Um, but that's all that is in that pocket. So on the inside, there is nothing really special in here either. Um, but this is what it looks like. There is a compartment here and then two on the sides and then just your main compartment in the middle. Um, so on the front compartment, I just have some diapers. These are the Pampers diapers. Honestly, I'm not a huge fan of Pampers, but we got a lot of like individual diapers um, through like diaper cakes and that kind of stuff at our baby shower. And so I'm just trying to use these up um, before I open up my box of Huggies because I'm just more of a Huggies fan. Um, but I always keep those right here in the front nice and handy. And then on the other side, I keep a little extra outfit rolled up because I am a boy mom, y'all. And sometimes you just open up that diaper perfect timing and he just decides to pee everywhere or he might have like a blowout. So I just keep some extra clothes. This is just a little puppy dog onesie, some matching um, joggers, and then some socks. And I don't really keep this like rolled up any special way. I just keep it all rolled up together and in the side pocket just for emergencies. <laughs> and then the other side, I just have the little baby nose bulb in there. This is the one from the hospital. Those are always the best. Make sure you take those home with you. And then we also have this little emergency like um, medical kit kind of thing. Um, this is what it looks like. It has a little mini nose bulb, a little medicine syringe, a little medicine spoon some nail clippers which honestly I don't know if I'll ever have the nerve to use those things. I have the baby nail file and I am absolutely in love with it. It's so gentle and so much easier to use. Um, check out my Instagram. I shared that a lot over there. Um, and then the most handy thing in here is the little mini um, uh, thermometer. Okay, so that's literally all this in the pockets. Like I said, nothing interesting. But then in this main compartment, the first thing I have is this little diaper caddy. Um, this was actually came with the other diaper bag that I had. And I just switched it into this one because I loved this thing. Um, so this is just a little gray diaper caddy. And it just unvelcros and opens up like this so you can lay baby on it this has been the best thing for me because whenever we're out in public i don't want to lay him on like the changing tables that are in like the restrooms i don't want to lay him on like um 
people's furniture, like if we're at company's house or whatever. Um, so inside of here, on this side, we just have some more diapers and then I have some butt paste. I'm just trying to use up uh, this little tube. I'm actually not a fan of this brand. Um, like I said, I share all of my mom favorites over on Instagram, but if you guys would like to see a video of what I personally love as a mom here on my YouTube channel, make sure you leave that in the comments down below. I would love to film that for you guys. Um, but I just have this little tube of diaper rash cream and then diapers. And then on this side, we just have a little pack of wipes. I actually just picked these up really quick from the grocery store at Aldi's. These are the Little Journey brand. Um, and they say that they're like 99% water compared to the Pampers Sensitive Skin ones. And those are the wipes that we usually use. So nothing really special in there, just your mom essentials. But this thing is so great. And I highly recommend having a diaper caddy in your diaper bag. Okay, and then the next thing inside of here is just a little blanket. Um, nothing that special, but I change out this blanket a good bit um, depending on the weather. So, like, one of my favorite mom tips is when you get home from being out with a baby, first thing you need to do is, of course, get your baby situated into the house, but then take your diaper bag straight to the nursery or wherever you have his his or her stuff and go ahead and restock the diaper bag so that the next day you're not running around like crazy trying to get the diaper bag ready get baby ready and get out the door it's already complicated enough so if your diaper bag is already ready it makes life so much easier so like for instance this blanket gets switched out between this one a thin swaddle and a fuzzy blanket i like check the weather for the next day when I get home and I change out the blanket accordingly. And then the next thing I have in here is just this like three in one, two in one, whatever it is, um, little cover. Um, so it just looks like, just looks like this. Um, so it opens up all the way through and I wear this a lot when I'm nursing in public. Um, it's the best thing for that. And then also it's like a car seat cover, stroller cover. Honestly, you can use it as a blanket, like whatever you need it for. This thing is so handy. I actually got that in my baby shower as well. And then the last thing in here is like right now my absolute favorite baby product, okay? And I also, again, share this over on my Instagram, um, but this is my favorite baby wrap. So my son wants to be as close to me as possible, like <laughs> at all times. And so baby wearing is like, the best thing for me if I'm in public I'm baby wearing if I'm needing to get things done around the house I'm probably baby wearing um so this is the baby Catan baby wrap and I absolutely love this one I used to have one of your like traditional tie wraps I have one of the, like baby carriers that you just sit them in and, like buckle it on and none of those really worked for me the wraps were just way too much fabric they were hot and thick and way too long and then like the baby carriers are almost just too big for my baby um, because he's pretty tiny. So this thing is amazing. I got it off of Amazon, but you can also order it directly from their website. And um, yeah, it's just the baby wrap. You put this on and then the bag actually flips inside out and becomes part of the wrap as well. So when you're done with it, you just wad it all up and put it back into its carrying bag. And if you guys would like to see a review on that, I would love to share that with you guys as well. But like I said, my diaper bag is pretty minimalistic. I don't keep too much in there, just really what I know I'm gonna need or use throughout the day with him but that is all I keep in my diaper bag. I really hope you guys enjoyed today's video. If you did, don't forget to leave it a thumbs up. Leave all of your video ideas in the comments down below and don't forget to subscribe to become a part of our little growing family here and without further ado, I'll catch you guys next time. Bye!